Over the past couple of weeks, retail businesses across the state have slowly started to open their doors back up and let customers inside. THV 11's Mercedes McKay spent the day downtown to see how shops are adjusting. Hayden, it felt a little more like a normal Saturday here in downtown Little Rock. Many customers going in and out of stores shopping, and the business owners I spoke to today said that everyone is optimistic but playing it safe. Well, we've managed to stay busy working on special projects and pivoting and adapting to the newness. Um, it's really exciting to see our friends that we haven't seen in two months. Local retail shops in downtown Little Rock, like Bella Vita Jewelry and Fringe Clothing, were getting by with online and curbside orders. This pandemic has been awful and it's been terrible being closed for two months, but we have really found light in it in focusing on our online website. While Arkansas slowly moved into phase one of reopening and the governor began to lift restrictions, Brandy McNair and Kendall Sandifer were both ready to open their doors last Friday with new rules in place. We limit the number of people in the store. Everyone has to wear masks. We're providing gloves and sanitizer and requiring that too. Cleaning, steaming, Lysol, hand sanitizer, and face masks. Implementing these restrictions is why shoppers felt comfortable spending their Saturday afternoon browsing inside stores. It's definitely a lot safer, you know, to go out because everybody's more aware of what's going on. While other customers told me they were anxious to get out, but were being careful about where they went. Both owners noticing the need for shoppers to just be outside of their homes. People are excited to get out um, and people are very cautious too. People are desperate to get out and they're really wanting to shop. Even though things may look a little different inside, there are silver linings all around. That's one huge blessing through the pandemic that I feel like it's drawn so much attention to local business. Both business owners were happy to see their regulars walk back into their doors and will continue to take these safety precautions. In Little Rock, Mercedes McKay, THV 11 News. Both owners say the last couple of weeks have been slow and steady with people trickling inside, but most of the sales right now are still coming from online and curbside.